So I'm going to copy this object over here, like so. Great. Hey, I was having fun copying objects in AutoCAD. You should have fun too. So let me show you some tricks and techniques that I use to copy objects in AutoCAD. Okay, so the number one technique or trick is use the end copy to copy your objects from XREFs or even blocks. For instance, here I have an XREF and I would like to copy this text over here, this special text that it is used for science and use it over here. So an old way can be to, you know, open the XREF and so on. But I'm gonna use the NC for end copy command. So once I do that, I can simply click this object and press enter. And then I can click and place my object or copy my object over here. Oops, it jumped over here. So, as you can see how easy, oops, it is because the snaps is on. So let me turn it back off and now you can place your object and you can change, you know, your sign as you wish. So again, the end copy to make your life easier, copying objects in AutoCAD. Next, use the control shift V shortcut. So let me go over here in this drawing and let's say for instance, I want to copy uh, this storefront door, but when I copy, I want to also make it a block so that way I can move things easier. So simply use the control C first to copy as usual, and then use the control shift and V and you will see that once you place it like so, this will become a block that you can move it quickly and nicely like so. Okay, so take advantage of that to make your life easier copying objects in AutoCAD. Okay, next, use the copy array option, right? You want to simplify your life. You don't want to make things more complex. So for instance, let's say I want to divide this storefront into three parts equally spaced. So what I can do is select my objects, use the regular copy command, and then I'm gonna specify, I'm gonna turn back on my object snaps for precision and I'm gonna specify my base point here click once and then if you see on the command line there is an array option so simply type a and press enter and here the number of objects to array would be four because here is one I want two three and four so I'm gonna type four and press enter now, at this point, AutoCAD is not giving me the nice option to click my next point. So what I'm gonna do is click the fit option. So click, and once you do that, you can simply click over here to place your objects like so. So at this point, simply remove these two lines over here and you'll see that you have your objects nicely spaced. As you can see, all of them are nicely with the same distance. Okay, so use that copy trick to make your life easier. And for the next trick that I want to share with you is the copy from template. So if we go over here on the layout 
one, you can see that I have an empty um, layout. So to make my life easier, what I do is instead of inserting a title block and all of the objects that I need in this drawing, I right click on the layout and then, oops, let me hide this so you can see better. I right click on the layout and then I choose from template. So once I do that, I can find the drawing where I have already a title block and all of the settings that I need. And if I open that drawing, you can see that I have a layout. So I'll select that and click OK. And now when you go to the next, um, this layout tab that just appeared, you can see that you have your title block and all of your settings already uh, ready for you to use. So take advantage of that uh, copy, of that way to copy objects for layouts, all right? Next, what I want to share with you is the copy with base point. For example, here I have a viewport that came from the previous uh, trick that I show you, but it's empty. There's nothing there. So what happened is that there was a drawing over there on that viewport somewhere here on model space. So let me open that drawing, right? So this is the drawing. And as you can see, there is a detail over there that I need. So this is where copy with base point comes handy. So basically you want to select whatever you need to copy, in this case, this detail and use the copy base. You can simply type copy base or you could also use its shortcut, control, shift and C. So once you do that, again, it's activating the copy base and I'm gonna say, 0, 0, 0, 0, and press enter. So once I do that and go back to my drawing where we uh, have this empty viewport and go to model space, I'm going to paste it with the regular control V. And I'm going to say 0, 0, 0, and press enter. So once I do that, and we go back to model, sorry to paper, boom. You can see that your viewport is now showing correctly your drawing, great, right? So these are some of the copy tricks and techniques that I use to make my life easier at the office where I work. So I hope they can help you too. And if you want to work even faster in AutoCAD, there are a hundred more tricks on the comments or thanks to my Patreon supporters and YouTube members, there are 10 more tricks over here in this video that I'll go over with you. So I'll see you over there.